Nate action here. We got my first nighttime video once I have my Phoenix 49 inch dual color light bar installed. This is most of my complete setup that I want, uh, more of the permanent style. And this is on the 2017 Ram 1500. It's got the fog lights on and the front and rear parking lights, just for reference. Uh, it's about 11 o'clock at night here, so it's been dark for a couple hours, overcast, uh, so there's not any interference with light. This is as dark as it gets. And I'll do a little walk around. I'll start off with the kind of the scene light, work light function and uh, go from there. All right, so this is uh, starting on the passenger quarter. We got the alley light. And those have the 40 degree optic on them, even though the entire rest of the bar has the 180 degree optic. All these clear modules have the 40 degree still. There's the rear work lights. And then the other alley light. And of course the takedown lights. And then you can kind of see in regards to the comparison to, I should say, the fog light. There's a shed. You can see the yard lit up out there about 100 feet back behind the truck. You can see how it lights up the shed even though it's far from a direct angle. The fog, the, the alley light is about out in this direction right out here. You can see how well it lights up the shed and it even gives a little off axis light. And that's mostly the takedown lights. The fog lights are just lighting up this area down here. So the, the work lights with those 40 degree optics do pretty good, pretty bright. Okay. And then this is the all amber version of the light bar that I've got. It's all the 180 degree, and that is without the takedowns or the alley lights flashing. All right, and then that is the cruise kind of on scene function. So when I'm responding to an emergency scene, I can run the uh, the blue more emergency mode I stickered the controller as and then this is the on scene kind of version where I can leave the blue cruise lights on and then the takedown and the rear work lights on to kind of help light up the area um, and then still have the blue lights uh, there so people know that it's blue but yet not have it flashing to be blinding people quite so badly and then slide position three on the controller is my response mode and that's the blue uh, i went with the same pattern as the amber just because that to me is a is a pretty uh pretty visible easily identifiable flash pattern and then for that i added in the clear flashing takedown and alley lights that phoenix gives the option to have so and that's that and there's back off again with just the fog lights and the marker lights. And this is about 150, 200 feet out uh, from the front at an angle to the vehicle. I'm um, probably at a 25 degree angle from the, f from the straight ahead of the vehicle. That way uh, you can kind of get a, get a feel for how off axis well that light bar does with that 180 degree optics. So. Uh, just yeah, just short little night video showing that before I get the extra uh, surface mount uh, fusions on the front and the puck lights uh, just to showcase the light bar.